Okay. Um, this here is going to be the... I forgot its name. Oh, Dawn, Harbinger of Solaris Flight. Uh, fighting him on my juggernaut here. Who's got Unbreakable. And Unstoppable. And I'm show you what else I got. Single target is going to be a double strike with stunt support, life leech, and multi strike. It's AoE attack. It's going to be ground slam, multi strike, faster attacks, life leech, and fortify. And the reason I'm using Ground Slam and not something like Sunder is because over here I have uh, two jewels that support it. Both of them are Rapid Expansion. It's a wider angle and um, creates uh, Endurance Charges. And then um, my uh, Movement Slash Teleport is a Leap Slam. Faster attacks and endurance charge and melee stun. Oh, and uh, he is also a counter attacker too. With repost. With faster attacks, although it's kind of pointless. And uh, endurance charge and melee stun. Same thing over here vengeance. Reckoning. And then also endurance charge and melee stun. Uh, and then uh, Stone Golem, not special on him. Determination gives me extra armor. And then Warlord's Mark with uh, Blasphemy attached to it. Um, I've only uh, I've only done this fight one time. I don't remember hardly any of the mechanics in it at all. But I do know that um, Dawn and Dusk one or both of them uh, I don't recall them being too difficult in fact uh, one or both of them actually went pretty quick it was just like, just like fighting a regular old plain Jane unique so I don't know which one of all, one of those they were but to be on the safe side I'm just going to go ahead and I'll probably set up a portal when I get in there yeah, here we go and let's hope my computer doesn't restart or let's hope my game doesn't crash as it has done a few times yesterday. Sun shafts. Right now I've got stormtrooper in. Get out of there. Too difficult. End up taking a ton of damage, probably from one of the sun attacks. But like I said, I haven't done this fight in a long time, so I don't remember much about it. What? 
That concludes the fight. Alrighty, all. Uh, this here is going to be the Dusk uh, Harbinger of Lunaris fight. Fighting about my juggernaut here. He's unbreakable. Uh, life regen, damage reduction. Hellacious life regen from uh, armor absorption. And he's also unstoppable. He's moves faster and can't be slowed down. Can't stop, won't stop. Let me show you what else I got. A single target is double strike. A stun support. Life leech. And multi strike. His AoE is ground slam with faster attacks. Multi strike, life leech, and fortify. And the reason I got I'm using ground slam and not thunder is because uh, I have two of these gems here. It increases its radius, and uh. You, uh gives a chance of giving me uh, endurance charges and I got two of them so and then I got a decoy totem with increased area effect and increased duration oh and also this guy is a counter attacker so as well as a uh, leap slam with faster attacks an endurance charge or melee stun. I've also got repost. Same thing. Then I got vengeance, reckoning. Both of them also have endurance charge or melee stun. Uh, and then a stone golem. Nothing special about him. Uh, determination. No support gems on that. Can't afford to. And then I got warlord's mark with blasphemy attached to it. Off I go, and let's hope my uh, computer doesn't restart or my game don't crash. Oh, and I know uh, I know next to nothing about this fight. I've only done it one time, uh, a long time ago. What I do recall though is uh, the fight not being that difficult. In fact, this might have been one of the few tank and spank fights I've done. The Solaris one wasn't it. I had to move around a lot because of sunbeams and whatnot. This is an easy one. One of the very few tank and spank fights I've had. Well, done and done. <laughs>